Hey everybody, welcome back to my kitchen. You guys, really quick today, we're getting ready to make some fish. And in an effort to get my batter really crispy, we're gonna be using two eggs. I'm gonna use maybe about a third cup of mayonnaise. Um, I'm gonna add just a little bit of Texas Pete. It's not gonna make it hot. You don't like anything hot, but it's gonna give it a little bit of flavor. And I normally use the House of Autry fish batter, but today I'm gonna be using the Louisiana seasoned crispy fish fry. I've never used this kind. I think sometimes that the House of Autry can be a little bit salty. So I'm gonna try this today to see if this makes a difference. I've already rinsed off of my flounder fillets and they are here. My grease is being preheated to about 360. We want to cook at about 350 degrees, but once we start dropping this fish, you know, it's going to cool down, cool down that grease, okay? Y'all already know I have thoroughly washed my hands. Don't be in the kitchen with nasty hands because that's just nasty. So I am very curious to see if this is going to give me the crispiness I need or I want. I'm very funny about fish. I don't like fishy fish. Does that make sense? I don't like fishy fish. We used to have fish every Friday and I was raised on Libby Hill. I don't do fish with bones. Like I said, my husband, we both love a fish that has a lot of, that's really breaded and crispy. So hopefully this is gonna give us what we're looking for. And um, we're gonna know in just a few minutes. So let's get this, I guess this batter mixed up. I'm not gonna season the fish with anything because the fish fry is seasoned, so. I think there's going to be enough seasoning in this as you know and and I just don't want to because I've also over seasoned it before and just adding a little bit of salt in my opinion or my experience before has made it a little too salty so we're not going to add anything we're going to let this do it and then our batter that we create hopefully that will be enough seasoning we're going to start with our two eggs To that we're going to add about, I can say about a third or fourth cup of mayo. Just a few dashes, maybe just a few dashes, not much at all. mixed up and smooth okay we have our batter smooth and now I'm just gonna add it to my fish we get the fish totally coated with the batter. Okay, my grease is ready and I added my breader to a Ziploc bag. at a time. Shake it, 
shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. I also like to let it rest a little bit before I just drop it in the grease that way. It can absorb this batter and the, the bread, the batter will absorb these, um, Lord, I want to say breadcrumbs, the breading mix. I don't want to just drop it in the fish, okay? I want this to be crispy. going to take about four minutes or so. It's not going to take long to cook these little fillets. Gonna let those sit. And I'm going to add these two. another minute or two and then I'm gonna drop them in the grease Frying. We're going to go on and take these out. These have cooked about three and a half minutes. And I'm going to drain them on this wire rack. I don't want them just sitting on a paper towel because that will make your fish soggy. Tell the difference. Between what? What's the matter? You trying to get your shoe on? Come here. Oh, I can pick it up. What are we telling the difference from? 
The other batter I used was House of Archery. Let you guys down a little bit. House of Archery. Uh -huh. Oh, that's pretty. It's golden. Did you look at that. I know it. This is piece. I broke off this piece right here. Break off that. Give me a whole piece. I'm a grown man. Well, bro, before you do that, let me get a thumbnail before you eat it all up. I show I ain't. I show eels. Hmm, I guess I need to get y'all back up now. Let me get done. Baby, back up a little bit. Well, I'm growing again. I'm growing again. Hold on, let me get back here with the grown people. Tall people. Tall people. refrigerators and stuff like that. I'm just. Slide to the right a little bit, babe. Don't tell me what to do, Donald. I'm grown. Okay. okay. <laughs> Babies, I'm trying to get a thumbnail back up. <laughs> Hold hands, Rachel. Wait, that's a long time. Okay. Babe. Mm -hmm. Stay focused, okay. please. Okay. That piece I broke off. This piece you broke off. This is supposed to be trying to. Yeah, I'm going to take it now. Can you tell the difference in that batter and, mm -hmm. and the other one? You can? Mm -hmm. Okay, what difference can you tell? Yeah. This. Y'all, these are some home fries I'm fixing now. Just cut up some potatoes. So salty. Well, I didn't add any seasoning to the actual fish this time. Mm. You like that one better? Or? It's yeah, mm -hmm. I hear you crunching. Which one you like? The is um, it is good. Well, y'all, that's the Louisiana. So you can tell the difference in that one and the other one. I just think, Jackson, you like it too? Do you eat some fish? Y'all, yeah. I just be wanting to get it to taste like the restaurant. Maybe I need to try it without, you guys tell me what you think. Maybe I need to try it using like the cornmeal and flour as opposed to a seasoned pre-made batter. Which one you like the best between this and the House of Audrey? The last one. This one? Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, this I'm, one? I'm not a big fish eater, so. I am. So you like it? So they have to add the, the accessories to it. Accessories? Tartar sauce. Oh. Slow. Spencer, what are you talking you know, about? That's accessories. That's why I eat tartar sauce and slow. What else can you eat on fish? I mean, some people eat ketchup. Mustard. Who eat? Who eat? Mustard. Who put mustard on fish? Who put ketchup on fish? I do. I do. When I eat it, I eat it with ketchup. Exactly. It's meat. And see, you guys, I'm the wrong person to ask about fish because, oh, he wants some more. Yeah, Come here. Want more. You want some more fish? Because I like fish sticks. Don't let that little boy start eating up all the box. Fish. He said he wants, wait a minute, say hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. Huh? You want some fish? Fish sticks is not real fish. Fish sticks. Yeah. You want some fish? Stick is not real fish. fish. That's me. That's fish by product. Is that good? I got <laughs> you say thank you, Nana. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Jackson yeah. approves. Look at the inside of y'all. Jackson will take it. So Jackson, here, you can hold it. Good? Mm hmm? Alright, you got. Are you cooking them a little longer? Yes, I like my fries. How are you gonna put the fries back in the grease? You want them crispy? Yeah. He want his fries to be like real done? Oh, yeah. He want you real fish want, and chips. He want potato chips, is what he wants. Okay, you guys, listen. If you've not subscribed, please consider doing so. By hitting the nosy. That's turning on that notification bell. That way you'll be notified whenever we're doing what we're doing. Yeah, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. You drop the fish. Is that good? That fish. You got, you got crispies, crispiness all over your face. Thank you guys so much for watching. We already look forward to you. Where are you going, babe? Right here. Okay. We already look forward to you joining us again next time. Two, did you try it? Bye. 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 Bye.